Starting in January 2012, I'll be the host of Hi folks, I'm Scott Martin, host of The Caddy Show on tourplayers.com, where the pros hang out. You uh, you've pl you played a couple of Champions Tour events this week, uh, this uh, this summer. Yeah. Did you play? Did you play just one or a couple? Three. You played three. Oh, you played the uh, U.S. Senior Open as well. I played the British Senior Open uh -huh. and the U.S. Senior Open, and then I got a, a sponsor exemption into the uh, the one in Des Moines, Iowa. Did Zach have anything to do with that? Helping you get a spot in that event? Yes. <laughs> Big from Iowa. <laughs> Of course he did. He's the Tiger Woods of Iowa. <laughs> yeah, I bet. If he uh, he called him up and well, actually they approached him at a outing one day and and uh, uh, said we'd heard your guy made it to the finals of the senior qualifying school and we'd love to maybe entertain the idea of having giving him a sponsor exemption mm -hmm. into the tournament and Zach was like, yeah, I'm sure he'd love yeah. it, you know and. And he called me up immediately and said, you know, these guys may be interested in, at the principal, in doing something for you. And yeah. I was like, cool. You know, I just finished 17th at the Senior Tour qualifying, and they only take five spots. And, uh, you know, I had the privilege of Monday qualifying, finishing in the top 30. Mm -hmm. And I was doing some of that on my weeks off. And uh, so it was, it'd been quite a busy year this yeah. year. Yeah, between the caddying and the playing and... Yeah, I actually caddied for Zach at the British Open. And uh, Sunday night after the British Open, I drove over to the qualifying course, played nine quick holes. And the next day shot 66 and got in the British Open. And I'd never played a major championship ever. Right. Wow. And now all of a sudden I'm playing two in a row. I'm yeah. playing the British right. and the, the US, US senior. Yeah. So. They, aren't they back-to-back -back weeks? Yeah, they were back-to-back. Yeah. -back, so how'd, how'd you play all in all out there this year? Well, I played really good. I shot to finish 13th in the senior open. Fantastic. Does yeah. that give you, does that get you in next year? Yeah. Okay. I'm in the next one next year. And I bogeyed the last two holes. I mean, as a caddy, you hate finishing off like that. Yeah. As a player, it's even yeah, worse. Yeah, it's gotta be magnified <laughs> for sure, yeah. for sure. But it was, you know, my biggest check ever before that was seven thousand dollars, and I made fifty-two thousand. Okay. You know, it's like wow. That's a nice check. You know, that's pretty good for a week off. Yeah. You know. <laughs> I'd say that was that was unbelievable. It really was. Now you're off to uh, Champions Tour Q School next week. Is that right? Yeah. The uh, starts Wednesday okay. at uh, Disney Palm. Okay. So we're going to try the is whole this, thing over again. Is this, what is this first stage, second stage? This is first stage. There's okay. only two stages. Okay. And where are and finals uh, held this year? They're at TPC Scottsdale, the course right across from the one we play on tour. Okay. Will you do the chicken dance if you get your card? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> how did that you all better believe it. How did that all start? Well, this, that comes from the mini tour days, uh, playing in here in the Orlando area. Uh, when I'd win a tournament, the guy <laughs> you got the neck going. Yeah, <laughs> I'd be walking around like this, like all strutting around. Yeah. And, and the guy that ran the tour, J.C. Goose, he said, started calling me Chicken. He says, "You walk around here like a chicken with his head cut off after you win a tournament." You know, I won 72 <coughs> tournaments or whatever, and uh, so I guess I did it quite a bit. Yeah. And uh, so then I'd played with Kenny the Hawk Harrelson, who was the announcer for the Chicago White Sox. Former great baseball oh, we player. We just talked about him last night. Yep. And uh, he was a member at Bay Hill, and we used to play some golf together. And the first time I played with him, he made a birdie. He broke off into this <laughs> chicken thing. I laughed my butt off. You know, I thought it was hilarious. And uh, so I was just sitting around one day, and I made a birdie playing in his group, and I took off doing a yeah. copy of his. And 
he liked it. He said, yeah. I think your may, yours may be better than mine. You know, yeah. I said, there's no way mine's better than yours, Hawk. You know, you're the king of that. And uh, so it just kind of, I started doing it when I got my Nike card and, uh, you know, the fans seemed to like yeah. it and uh, just kind of took off. I remember you did it at the, the Bell South. Yeah, I, just I try it. to do it for victories now when right. I can remember it. I'm 50 years old now. It's right, kind of yeah. hard to remember sure. to do things. Yeah, of so. course, the memory's growing, I'm sure. <laughs>